Hey, what's going on, guys? Quick little video. I want to talk about um, the reason why I lift. I'm loving it right now, like a McDonald's commercial. Uh, it's due to the fact, guys, I have, you know, I tell you guys all the time, ADHD. It causes you to be fixated on um, things that sometimes are out of your control in regards to winning, okay? So with me right now having, you know, the ADHD, uh, me having um, stability, having, um, you know, things working, moving smooth for me, now having, you know, not just um, the job, whatever you want to call it, but now doing this lift um, for about 80 hours a week, which is going to allow me to make close to $2,000 uh, a week before taxes and gas and all of that. Um, I'm happy because, you know, I have guaranteed money coming in and I got the money from other um, uh, avenues. Now, remember, the other avenues are gambles. Ultimately, you don't know what you're going to make each week. But with Lyft, you know what you're going to make for the most part. Now, you know the lowest amount you're going to make. Because out here in L.A., you might have to maneuver your schedule around. Like yesterday, I started working at, I think, 11 o'clock. And I finished at about 6. And then I went to go um, um, do the live with you guys. And then I hooped or whatever. Or actually, I ended it at 4.30. And I did live with you guys. And I went to go hoop after. And I took you know, the rest of the day off. Now, today, I'm back at it doing 12 hours. Because I know later the better. Uh, because when I started doing lift after doing spark um, for a couple hours, it was trash. Uh, I started doing lift at about 3.30. It was nonstop rides. Or at 3 o'clock, nonstop rides. And I even got some XL rides. So um, I know now with lift, it's just what it was last year around this time. You got to work late. You work late, you can get XL rides, you get the good rides. So that's what I intend on doing. Now, I want y'all to understand, I need that structure, okay? And yes, this might not be as much money as I can make doing the other things, but for my mind's sake, this is better because I'm able to put in these hours knowing that I'm making the base number that is gonna allow me to pay all my bills into the month, take care of everything, and all the other money is just extra money that I eventually be able to make moves with. Now, you know, with me having this guaranteed money coming in now, it allows me to be happy enough to call my friends, family, you know, chat. You know, I'm actually making friends out here. You know, I met some people, you know, doing Lyft uh, while doing Lyft, you know, um, that I'm going to uh, see about having them come on the podcast. They're interested in doing that. So there's a lot of moving parts in my life that I'm happy that are um, going the way that I feel like I want them to go. Let me button up my second button here. So that's the reason why with Lyft, I'm happy doing Lyft right now because it's enough money more than enough money for me to actually have a good life because eventually what's going to happen is i'm going to um you know do the lift schedule that most drivers that make the most money do out here which is like early morning like five to like 11 so you get the surge money and then at 11 they stop take a break and then they get back out at like um six to like nine and they do it like that they break it up um and they get their 10 to 12 hours in i don't know though if i want to do that though because of the fact that gap in between is going to kill me. I'm not going to want to go back on. So I might just start working super early and then like knock it out early. And then that way I have the rest of the day because eventually I want to start going out to like socialize and make, you know, friends and get into the um, entertainment industry, you know, and it ain't trying to be an actor or anything like that. I'm talking about like, there's so many bars and restaurants and all that, that need um, a boost. I didn't realize that until I met that guy yesterday and I met a few other people, but I didn't really believe them. But I believe this guy yesterday or two days ago who was um, telling me about what he do. Um, and, you know, I didn't ask for his contact info because I thought it was kind of creepy. I was like, no, nah, I ain't gonna do that. But he gave me enough info to know that there's bars that have kitchens that don't have a cook because they can't afford a cook because their business is slow. So I'm gonna go around my area, around this little neighborhood, and I'm gonna go to bars and see, you know, bars that um, have a food menu, but they don't have a cook. You know, they don't have a cook, so they have food menu, but they can't, they ain't open all the time. And I'm gonna see about going in there, maybe I start as the cook, you know, um, to where I buy the food, I prepare, you know, I do everything on my own, and I just make money off of uh, the customer base they already got. Now, of course, I would have to bring in new customers. And that would be um, more towards the food, specials, giving out flyers, getting people to come um, check it out. You know, eventually be able to do delivery through DoorDash, whatever such. That's the option. You got to understand, your life is not defined. You got to define it. You got to make your life your life. And um, you got to figure it out. And I came to California to set up opportunity to um, have something great that I would be able to, um, you know, uh, once a year towards, but 
um, contribute to my um, family, you know, my kids, you know, be able to have something that, you know, they can um, look forward to. And with what I have available with skills and uh, set and everything that I have right now, it ain't nothing that's going to be able to be passed down to them or they're going to be able to earn from. You know, not saying they have to earn because my son and my daughter are smart enough to, you know, get their own money. But at the same time, I want to be able to set them up to be able to have um, a backup plan in case what they want to do, um, once they don't work, but it's not as um, lucrative as um, we would think because, you know, the country's changing every single day. You know, every day something that was great yesterday is not great today. So that's the reason why I'm pushing forward, pushing through. And the reason why I actually appreciate um, Lyft um, at the moment with XL and, and um, you know, the premium rides, whatever. But I'm not going to say I love Lyft or anything like that because they can switch up tomorrow the rates on you. They can literally, like, like the algorithm could push you to where you don't get rides for, like, an hour because they don't want you to hit, like, this $4, um, you know, um, ride bonus. You know, um, there's so many things that Lyft do that are shady. You know, I hate Lyft as a company. But right now, I just appreciate the opportunity to make the money doing what I am doing in regards to ride share. So I want y'all to understand, I'm happy, you know, and I know y'all be thinking I'm fake and happy, but I'm happy. When y'all see me chill like this to where I'm not yelling, I'm not like, I don't care about like people's admiration and being on live to, you know, be lit. That's because I'm, I'm happy, truly in my heart, happy. I don't need those, those, um, um, let's call it artificial, um, things to create happiness in my life. I'm happy just doing what I'm doing right now, which is getting, um, guaranteed, you know, money, um, without hoping that something's going to shake, you know, I'm making what I'm making based off of, um, you know, what I'm doing at the moment, which is, um, lift and I'm doing my, you know, other little side projects, my side money. But, um, with that said, there's a lot more that I uh, look forward to doing because, you know, eventually, you know, the sky's the limit out here in LA. I want to build, I want to build onto this platform. You know, I want to build and, um, you know, get out to the masses i want to go worldwide you know i got a couple countries that do watch my videos crazily i don't know if the subtitles are how they do it but they watch my videos because you know um most of my traffic half my traffic almost half my traffic is from um is international so of course you know i'm only 500 400 views a video so that ain't really nothing to brag about you know i'm not doing big numbers but what i'm saying is um, I want to continue putting out these pre-recorded videos because already I see my subscribers going up a little bit, um, up five, only five, but still that's a good start from two days of pre-recorded videos. Eventually, one of these videos are going to um, go um, viral, um, and then that's going to bring in new eyes and new people, and then eventually we're going to do some more lives, and then we're going to like you know um, boost this up. But with that said, yesterday I don't think I hit. I think I hit maybe $70, you know, but today is going to be 250 at least, you know, 12 hours. And I say 250 because I'm not going to set the goal too high to where if I don't hit it, I'm down and I'm like, oh. no, we're going to say 250 because I'm happy with 250. I hit 250, I'm good, you know, um, that's pretty much enough for me to make except, you know, right about 1700 for the week, but I should do a little bit more than that, but let's just say 250 but as I cut this app on let's see what pops up I'm gonna cut it on right now always turn that the hazard lights on on the accent it says lift us into text and said you can make two to three dollars extra on every ride during bonus hours first one's at 11 a.m. missed out on that one I didn't know that started at 11 a.m. let's see let's turn on um, oh shoot bonus hour right now but it's over See, I'm screwing up already. I missed both bonus hours. It should have started at 11 o'clock today. Being real with you guys, it should start at 11 o'clock. It's all good. I'll catch it tomorrow. Tomorrow's at three and out. That's confusing. Um, looks like the bonus hour tomorrow is at three o'clock. Yeah, three o'clock. And then it says one. Oh, 3 a.m. tonight. And then 1 p.m. and then seven. So, ain't that big of a deal. Um, you know, I would have got three rides, would have hit extra nine dollars. So I'm gonna go online right now. Maybe I catch one. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, you gotta be downtown area. At half the time, you don't be downtown um, getting rides. So we're gonna see what comes up. 
but yeah, uh, guys, that's a little update of uh, what's going on. You know, um, I'm loving lift right now, like McDonald's, loving lift. Um, I'm gonna do this. Um, I'm gonna continue doing this. I'm gonna maintain it. March first, we're gonna get that thirty thousand. And you know, I hope a lot of you guys. Um... Okay, so they actually are offering now this weekend. See that this weekend they're offering for seventy rides, one hundred fifty-five dollars. Taking that, I'm gonna do that for sure. So that'd be one hundred fifty-five additional dollars. So that works out perfect. But yeah, um, I'm loving Lyft. Okay. So this ain't an infomercial for Lyft. I'm not referring anybody. I don't have a link to share. You know, this is just me um, speaking on um, obvious because of um, what's going on right now um, with me, um, my mental health, with everything involved. So with that said, I'm about to get to the grind. I'm about to, um, you know, get a, uh, a ride soon, hopefully. Let me make sure I'm on, um, I gotta make sure my ride type is on Okay, premium and extra comfort. Yep, we'll leave it there for now. Because I'd rather wait around and get like two of those an hour to pay 25 uh, bucks total than to do like a bunch of X rides. So those X rides, that'd be like three miles for like $4 or three miles for $3.89. I'm, I'm not trying to mess with that. That's just a waste of my time. So we're gonna try to get the big, the big money here. Um, but with that said, that's all I got. Uh, appreciate y'all for tuning in. Appreciate all those that show love those that continue who want to um you know see where i end up um you guys rock with me i'm gonna keep you guys updated on the daily it's gonna be pre-recorded for now i'm gonna go live on occasions i gotta switch this channel up because ultimately that going live every day thing did not help at all because you know my views my new subscribers came from those two shorts that um clean bins did for me you know but in regards to me obtaining new subscribers um I did live for like a whole three weeks, every day, hours, and I didn't really gain no new subscribers. But for two days, I've been doing pre-recorded videos and I gained five subscribers. So, I mean, lives isn't worth the time, um, you know, and the drama around it. Not for this channel right now, I don't think. I think pre-recorded videos ultimately do better and the more of them I do, the more that I'm going to um, grow. Um, more that good things gonna happen. But with that said, that's all I got for now. Appreciate y'all for tuning in, checking me out. Let me do a thumbnail photo. All right, that's all I got. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe if you're not subscribed. Hit the like button, show me some love so we can get an algorithm. Like button and comment below if you think that I'm, um, you know, more solid by having, you know, guaranteed income coming in instead of all over the place hoping that um, I make money this day or this this week. I mean, don't you think guaranteed income is better than no income? And remember, guys, that nine to five, yes, that nine to five life is for a lot of people. Majority of people do nine to fives, you know, but I'm I'm trying to put myself in a position to be able to create a business or you know, have an opportunity that's going to allow me to, you know, push forward. So that's where I'm at with that. So with that said, I appreciate y'all once again, all the love and support that you guys give me. That's all I got for now. Um, I will respond to the comments, by the way. I will respond to the comments. But that's all I got. I'm out. Peace.